So I'm gonna explain in this video why as you age, these earlobes start growing, okay? And your nose starts growing and your eyebrows start growing excessively. You've seen older men with these bushy eyebrows, long ears and the nose. And of course the hair is out of the ear and the nose. Why is that? What is happening? Is there something we can do about it? Or is it just inevitable? We're just gonna have to cope with it. Well, the answer is yes, it's inevitable. You have something to look forward to. Um, but here's the thing, your bones actually stop growing uh, in the early 20s, maybe a little bit before that, okay? But the cartilage will continue to grow a very, very small amount as you age. And the tip of your nose is all cartilage, so are your ears. And there's also a bit of lack of connective tissue, so you don't have um, something to hold that cartilage together, so things start to droop and sag all over the place. But then you also have another thing going on for men primarily. Uh, you have this spike in something called DHT. DHT is a very powerful type of testosterone. And there's an enzyme that will start to convert testosterone to DHT. And that will lead to hair loss, male pattern baldness. But at the same time, you get an increase of hair growth in the eyebrows, in the hairs in the ear, in the hairs in your nose, and even in the size of the prostate. So that's another thing you have to look forward to. Uh, just make sure that you trim them on a regular basis. Now, there's an enzyme inhibitor. It's called 5-alpha reductase inhibitor, and it just so happens to be in pumpkin seeds, and it's in quite a few other things, which I'll show you a video, but this enzyme will slow down the process of this GHT. And that may result in some improvements in other parts of the body. So anyway, I wanted to clear up that little mystery. And if you're interested in knowing what will decrease DHT, I put a link right here. Check it out.